How's it going guys, Spectre Production here today. And today as you can see in front of me is the new 2022 um, Nissan Frontier. Now starting off with the looks, um, looks a lot like the Tacoma. The, uh, yeah, uh, this, uh, Toyota Tacoma. But it looks a lot better than the previous one. The previous one looked kind of, uh, kind of, it looked good, but it kind of looked lousy. This one is more, um, more like uh, pumped up and ready to go sort of um, look. So, as you can see, new style headlights. They look really nice. We also got the new Nissan logo and uh, Frontier indented on here. Uh, this is a, I think, Pro 4X trim, so that's going to be the top, top trim. Here's the interior, if you guys will be able to see it. There it is. You can see some red accents there. Pro 4X seats. Here's the rear. No, you can't see the rear. Well, you can, but it's not that big. So yeah, the Frontier is a small truck. As I said, it's about the size of a um, of a Toyota Tacoma, and it looks a lot like the Toyota Tacoma, which is what I was always thinking about whenever I first saw when it, this was revealed. Whenever I first saw this, I was like, "This is just a Toyota Tacoma, really." But nonetheless, it still looks good. Definitely, as I said, better than the last one. Here it is in a different color. This is more of a, a gray color, uh, more of a gray. And as you can see, the body panels are actually matched. So the grille and the bumpers are now same uh, colors. Here's an, another look at the new Nissan logo. Looks a lot nicer. So, if I'm not mistaken, that one might be a bit shorter. This one might be a full cab. I don't know, maybe that's what it looks like. This one's a four-wheel drive. Here it is on the rear. You can see Frontier engraved on here. It does look really good, don't get me wrong, but it just looks a bit, uh, not a bit, a lot like the Toyota Tacoma, which is what... Uh, it doesn't disappoint me, it just, you know, kind of makes it feel pointless, really, because, like, new Tacoma, I mean, the Tacoma and this, they look exactly alike, almost, as I said. No, as I said, nonetheless, though, still looks good. Definitely a bigger upgrade. Here's the interior of this one. I think that might be a more simple trim. Not entirely sure. So yeah, um, comment your thoughts down below. I'll try responding to them. I mean, I always do. And um, yeah, I'll put in some also specs of like the engines. I think they're gonna be only like one engine option here, especially here in Canada. But, because there's probably not gonna be any diesels. Maybe in the Europe, in Europe there's gonna be more diesels. But yeah, I'm gonna put in engine options and stuff. And just, yeah. So yeah, comment down below your thoughts, and I will see you guys on my next videos. Peace!